Welcome to Techrix Info, the engineering tutorial hub. Uh, today, let's identify uh, the automobile and the hydraulic system of a JCB machine. A uh, JCB machine uh, is a combination of hydraulics and automobile because the machine needs to mobile, so it has this uh, powertrain which helps us to mobile that is the automobile system and uh, here we'll have the hydraulic system the hoses and the different valve blocks and pump which uh, helps the machine uh, to excavate and to load that means uh, the applications which have been done by this machine so let's identify the automobile components uh, that is a powertrain which includes the radiator uh, so this is the radiator which is uh, the front part of the uh, machine and automobile part then comes the engine over here and we have uh, the front axle uh, here okay after the engine it comes uh, the torque converter it's a fluid uh, coupling unit so it's the torque converter and from the torque converter the drive uh, is getting towards the gearbox so here we have the gearbox and from the gearbox uh, through the propeller shaft the drive reaches the rear axle and this is the rear axle so this is the automobile uh, part of a jcb machine which helps the machine uh, to uh, drive or ride through the road for the transportation purpose so uh, engine provides uh, the power or it is a prime mover uh, which is transmitted through the torque converter and the gearbox which reaches the rear axle and the uh, front axle finally the drive reaches the wheels which helps uh, the jcb machine uh, actually to mobile so that's the automobile part now let's see the hydraulic components and the hydraulic part uh, these actually help uh, the jcb machine to do its different work of excavation and loading so uh, here we have the loader valve block that means uh, from this valve block the hydraulic flow is being transmitted towards the loader control levers here we have the loader which has the lift ram uh, and uh, the shovel ram so the hydraulic flow reaches these ramps through this loader valve block and the uh, MRV is also located at the loader valve block okay and this is the hydraulic pump it is a uh, two section uh, pump it's a gear type single section double delivery uh, pump so here we have uh, the hydraulic pump and we have uh, uh, the excavator valve block over here on the rear of the machine so this is the excavator valve block and the excavator valve block is the uh, unit through which uh, the hydraulic flow is being controlled towards uh, towards the excavator side on the excavator we have uh, uh, the excavator bucket ram uh, the dipper uh, hydraulic ram the boom ram and the slew ram etc so the hydraulic flow reaches these excavator controls through this uh, excavator valve block and here we have uh, uh, the hydraulic tank over here so this is the hydraulic tank where the hydraulic uh, oil is being stored and this hydraulic uh, oil is being transmitted uh, through uh, these valve blocks and these ramps and uh, when a restriction is there actually the pressure uh, is being created and against uh, that pressure the work is been happening so that's uh, how the whole uh, system is actually working and here uh, this is the hydraulic oil getting cooled over here here we have two units one is the radiator and also uh, the cooling of the hydraulic system is also happening over here so the oil gets uh, cooled at uh, this section so i believe you got an idea about the automobile components uh, that means the engine torque converter gearbox and the axles which helps to mobile the machine and uh, the hydraulic components the loader valve block the excavator valve block the hydraulic pumps the connecting hoses etc the hydraulic tank etc which helps the machine to do its excavation and its loading work for more engineering tutorial video updates please click the subscribe button on top of this video if you have find this tutorial useful please click the like button or drop a comment to motivate us we are also available on facebook thanks for watching this video